In this video we're gonna discuss the Android 14 uh, fix for Fermara Arrow and the uh, card stream. We know that with the new uh, Android Arrow 14 update uh, some uh, smartphones lost uh, the uh, ability to use Fermara or uh, uh, card stream on the Android uh, Arrow platform. So in this uh, uh, video I'm going to show you how to do that. Before we start I'm going to show you what we need in order to do that. We need this Android Arrow uh, wireless adapter which comes from AA uh, Wireless. I'm going to have the link down uh, below in the description and uh, that's how it looks like comes with the USB cable which we're gonna plug into uh, the uh, car port and once we uh, plug the uh, adapter in we're gonna go on the uh, uh, Bluetooth settings which is gonna be AA uh, wireless we're gonna tap on pair and then um, we're gonna follow uh, the uh, instructions on the screen here but uh, first uh, while we're waiting for that we can uh, head to Play Store and look for the uh, uh, AA wireless app and as you see we already uh, have it uh, hooked up we're gonna go to the settings and uh, we're gonna head to advanced settings and we're gonna enable the developer mode this is an important step without this step uh, nothing gonna work so uh, pay attention to this and make sure you have uh, this enabled will be developer mode and now uh, the uh, uh, unit is gonna uh, restart and to talk a little bit about this uh, AA uh, wireless adapter, I really liked it. It only takes 12 seconds uh, for the Android Auto uh, to load up from the moment you uh, start the car. So I think it's a pretty good uh, option if you are looking for a wireless uh, uh, adapter. Uh, if you are wondering how to install Fermara Auto uh, or uh, uh, CarStream, I will have the video into the uh, uh, description of this video. Uh, follow the instructions there. Uh, and then uh, along with this adapter you will uh, be able to uh, have those apps uh, up and running and as you can see here on the screen I do have Fermara Arrow and the, uh, um, it works as it should and as you can see we got YouTube uh, working here on the uh, screen and I'm gonna do a quick uh, demo here it's gonna be a little bit harder without the uh, uh, actual uh, touch screen but we're gonna be able to see whatever uh, YouTube recommends us and this app by the way can be used uh, uh, without a touch screen as well because uh, it supports the uh, cursor mode or mouse mode with the uh, uh, non touch screen uh, uh, cars as you can see we got a uh, Fermara Auto working and I'm gonna go uh, quickly and demonstrate the uh, um, car stream as well now we got the car stream here car stream is a little bit harder to use without a, a touch screen mode so um, that being said this is pretty much the uh, fix for uh, uh, this uh, uh, Fermara Auto and uh, on Android Auto. And I'm gonna have uh, the links uh, down below into the video description. Uh, but this is not the only way to watch YouTube and Netflix on Android Auto. Uh, there is another solution with those uh, uh, Android boxes that uh, are getting connected the same way that this uh, little device uh, gets connected to the car. I'm gonna have the link in the video description. Those are a great way to uh, uh, watch uh, YouTube and uh, other apps as well. So uh, if you have any questions, uh, leave down uh, in the uh, comments and I will try my best to respond but I hope you like this video if you like this kind of content feel free to uh, click like and subscribe for more similar videos I will see you in the next video